Hello everybody and welcome back to an, an, another one of my videos. Now, uh, for this video I am I would be showing you how to install the 9 season Winfield Cup mod uh, 1988 all the way through to 1996 modifications for your Rugby League Live 3 game. Uh, I'll put this link in the disc description it's the download links now uh, these are the download links the raw media file uh, media file files and this one is just an update this one the updated commentary one didn't really work for me uh, I opened up in a new time and says something appears to be missing so yeah that file it didn't work so once you've downloaded these three files what you want to do is you want to go into your downloads folder find the mod that you want to do I want I want to do the 1991 folder but first there's something really important which you have to do within the raw files you'll find one main save file which is this fed 001 dot serve and you want to, please first you need to make a backup of any of the current save files you have and copy it into your um, into your documents my games slash rugby league live live 3 folder and I've already done that I'll bring it up here so yeah as you can see it's I've already got the fed 001 file served in here now and let's get back to the other one so um, it's in my downloads folder it is right here so I'm going to go into the 19 and then one folder and then go into 1991 as you can see you got these three files in here now if you read here mods folder now what you need to do with this mods folder first we want to bring our documents folder back up you want to drag these two and drag it drag and drop it into there I've already done it with the 1991 mods they're all here and oh yeah and you really have to keep this in mind you can only run one of them at a time okay so you can only run one of the seasons at a time like for example you can't run the 1988 season and the 1994 seasons at the at the at the same time and this will only work in the career mode by the way it'll only have all the players when you're in the career mode now oh what you want to do is you want to go to your uh, well, whichever drive you have your whichever drive you have your Steam games on, and then you go down and you find your Steam folder, and you find your Steam apps, and, and you find the common, you find Rugby League Live Three. Here it is here. Then, then you'll see all these files, right? Now, this is now you simply drop this file here and this is the file from the 1995 mod that I tried earlier uh, so yeah just yeah just that's yeah that's fine and actually if, if I go back into well that's really all we need for that uh, so we'll close that out and it's the same for all of them it's the same it's in installation process for all of them then I'm actually going to go back up into my downloads folder. I'm going to go into this, and as you can see, all the folders are still here. And uh, if you uh, quickly want to change out the mods, for example, if you go to the 1988 and you and you want to jump to 1990, it'll ask you to replace all the files in the destination. That's fine. Just hit yes. And yeah, it'll work fine. Uh, folders will still be in there. Okay, that's really it. And then it'll come back up, and then it'll work. Yeah, uh, yeah, and this will be in the descriptions. Exit. Rebelly Life Three. Uh, as you can see, the game is loading up just fine. Um, and once the game loads up you will be 
greeted by he should be greeted by this he should be greeted by this intro screen hit a get to begin and this is how you know that your mod worked this This is how you know that your mod worked. You have all these things up here. All this stuff you got, uh, as you see the fan hub, you got Peter Sterling and the Wally Lewis, the fan hub. Um, and just start this, you want to go into the create. If it says not yet began, that's fine, that's what it should be. Then choose your what you want to be I want to be a coach now look at this it's got all the older teams very cool I want to coach my favorite team the Independent the Panthers I really want to affiliate with those choose whatever spot as you want and what bam bam this is the mod it's a very good mod I'll put it on pro, I'll leave it on pro. I'll turn the half length down to five minutes. Put it on pro, I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I'll just... You know what? We'll put it back on pro. Uh, now I'll be back with you, uh, going to play one game. Go to simulate the Auckland Nines, because I'm not really interested in it. Raiders won it. Just the preseason matches, and of course, of course, um, we've got injuries. Alexander, are you kidding me? Why, Greg Alexander? God damn it. Uh, well, that sucks. Al Alexander's gonna have to be sw switched off. Does does the team have another halfback? So if the team actually does, why is Izzard on the bench, man? I like Izzard. Izzard was is Izzard's an absolute legend. Could this? Yeah, we'll hop him for Ben Alexander. And I I I I. I Kinda want Izzard on, so we'll switch through that. Go up, hit the accept button. Here we go. Let's play a game. Uh, it has all the older jerseys. Let's be another away jersey, home jersey, and here we go. So this is the mod. It's very, very nice mod. And when you're learning a bit of a game, you should get this learning screen right here. Hit A to continue. And we've got the and we've got the Steelers Hello, and the Panthers. Um no, I'm gonna turn the commentary down a bit. Where is it? What are you saying? Commentary? Just down. Tinsy bit. That's a bit better. Okay. Actually the just the game itself is a little loud. We'll turn it down a little bit. Turn it down. Crowd down. Let's be good down. Alright, here you go. So, uh, yeah, as you can see, the field, the markings, the players, the jerseys, everything is exactly like it from 1991. Uh, and it is egg. And it in. Um, it, it's 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 the same for all the other mods. They are basically just the replicas of those of those older seasons. Now I know that a lot of you won't really like be interested in this or like know any of the players that played in this uh, time period of the in New South Wales uh, rugby league or the or the Winfield Cup as it was called back then. Um, I just I still love this mod. 
either way, I do think that is a very nice mod that they've uh, put in into the game. Oh, go Fiddler! Fiddler's away! I shouldn't have passed, actually. I should not have done that. Kind of run the perfect run. Uh, Barwick! What was that ball? Uh, ben Alexander. Oh, shoot. Actually got a pretty good run up there, Ben Alexander. Give it to... Paul Clark. Oh, what a ball. No, oh, God! Nip! Um, I first saw this mod. There was this guy on YouTube posting uh, Ryu plays of the 1991-1990 and like all the finals that were capable of remaking and remastering with this mod and I loved it. I thought, man, I have to get this. I, man, I really have to get this for my game. And I did. And I, I'm not disappointed in the use slightest. I highly, highly recommend that you download this mod. Why did I go this way? I don't think I should have went this way now. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That was actually pretty good. That was pretty good, man. Hey, that's pretty good. Mark Gaia. Why did bloody um Alexander have to get? How is that not an knock on, bro? He hit the ball. What? How is that not a knock on on the Steelers side, man? Uh, get it. Yeah. <laughs> um, one of my favorite things about this, uh, I haven't used the updated commentary mod. Uh, because as I said at the beginning, the file, it did not work for me. It said that the file was missing, and what the hell was Ro Riolio doing? He just ran right in touch. And also, just another thing in general, I highly re recommend that you get this version of the game, and not the console version of the game. This version looks and just feels, it, it looks and feels as like a lot better, as better animations. It looks a lot better, more commentary, like, like, there's more lines that the commentary say. And, at the beginning, uh, when I first played this game, I did think that it, I, because I was playing on the Xbox, I didn't think that it was going to be that, uh, I thought it was just uh, going to be like, you know, something like the Red Dead Redemption port for the PC, you know, like, just like a, just like a very poor PC port up to console port, but no, this is very better. This is a lot better, so if you're looking to buy this game, it is 100% worth the 30 bucks, and you should 100% buy, buy, buy the game. Not only just to play like this mod, like, you, like, the game is amazing on its own anyway, and Mark Gaia, of course, Mark Gaia makes the high tackle on the substitution. But, uh, yeah, I highly recommend that you buy this game if you have the money. It is worth every cent that you spend. It is so good. Uh, switch him off for of Van Der Voort. Go back. <laughs> okay, but as you can see, the mod runs perfectly fine. Um, and there is going to be actually a special announcement at the end of this video. Show that I didn't mention that at the beginning of the video. I'll put it in the video title. Uh, 
But yeah, there's going to be a very special announcement at the end of this video. Or big kit. Oh, that's the end of the first half. Ah, uh, we'll do another switch. Uh, actually, oh, I kind of, I do want Vanderbilt on. Well, yeah, we'll put it in there. Uh, I like, I like Vanderbilt. <laughs> Uh, we'll go down. That's the kickoff, and um, it is a good idea to get the updated commentary mod because some of the names here in the just in the normal mod, like some of the names are a bit um, uh, like they're not they're not a, like exactly like what they were like actually back in '99, like like. For example, if you guys were paying attention at the beginning of the video when I just got into the game, you would have noticed that the um, when they when both of the teams' uh, images came smashing onto the ground, he they didn't say Illawarra Steelers. They didn't say anything, in fact. And even like yes, yeah, so like they they don't know how to say Illawarra. Illawarra Steelers because they didn't, you know, program them. They didn't like say, oh, you say the Illawarra Steelers or anything like that. So, um, and just not only that, it's just like this mod is very good. Like just for those of you that, like, like me, didn't see, didn't see what all the fuss was about back in the day, and like you didn't see how how good 90s, 90s, uh, late 90s and late 80s and mid 90s rugby league is. This is, uh, it, it's not really like bringing it back to life. Well, it is. It's a very good mod. And honestly, it's a must have for any a, a rugby league fan that loves those old 90s games that owns this that owns this game. I highly recommend it. It's amazing mod. And as you can see, uh, I don't know if those of you that noticed, but the balls uh, are exactly like the ones that, that they used in 99. Please, Gaia, make up for the high tackle. No. Um, uh, yeah, so like everything is basically, it's very like, it could be either for nostalgia or you want to see what all the fuss was about back in the day. Oh my god! <gasps> Knock on! No! If only he would have picked up the ball, that would have been a try. No, I bombed it. This is on amateur as well. What happened? God damn it, man. Um. Yeah, this mod's very good. So, switch it back. Get him. It's a big ticket. If you guys want me to attend this, like, do like a season playthrough with some teams, please uh, just comment down below the teams that you want me to play with. First, of course, I'm gonna do a playthrough with the uh, the Panthers first because uh, they're my favorite team. After that, comment down your team search suggestions, and I'll I'll do it. Uh, the announcement that I will make at the end of the video, I'll also make be making a full video about it later. But the announcement is just for those people that like didn't see the video. And there we go, we got our first try. There we go, Steve Carter. Uh, and as you got like a close up of the players there, they do look a lot like the ones from 1990. From 1991, sorry. I don't think this is gonna go in. Ah, uh, never mind. No, that's in. Brad Fittler, let's go. Like nobody, like, like this mod is. It's a great mod. It it just adds a lot more just to the base game. And uh, another thing to mention about 
and just another thing that I'd like to mention is I was thinking of making one of my own mods like this, but with the early 2000s teams uh, on the Rebel League Life 4, and I am. I'm, says, I'm still working on that mod. Uh, the jerseys are not done yet, the players are not done yet, and I can't believe I'm actually about to be tied up on amateur. I'm a lot better at the game than this, okay? I can believe me, okay? Uh, should we go short kickoff? You know what? I'm gonna go a little bit cheeky here. This might either backfire go very well. Uh, it went well. It went well. Notice. Smash him. Yay! Ah! Oh, get him! Get him! It's like, even like, just like, I swear I'm not sponsored by a big ant, like, to make this video supporting the modification or anything. This is purely my actual opinion on the game. They big ant have every right to be proud of this game. It's an amazing game. It is a must-have for every single rugby league fan. It is true. Willis. Look at this. They're shifting the ball. Oh, my God. It's just like real Penrith Panthers from last year. <gasps> All right. So, we only got one point. Oh, an amateur. Are you kidding me? I don't think I really want to make it changes. Should I go short? game okay I, I, I actually do like I actually am I'm a lot better maybe, maybe just because I'm recording maybe the nurse came to me I don't know though. Ooh, Walsh Ooh, take it now Ooh. Ooh, big kick uh, by the way, when I'm finished with this game, I'm going to show you what happens if you go to try and play a game. Uh, just like with the normal, uh, just like, play like a casual, casual, casual game modes. Um, uh, I'll, I'll, show you. I'll show you once we get, once this game is finished, I'll show you. It's kind of weird what happens. Oh god, no, 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 I'm not losing at Golden Point on Amateur to the Illawarra Steelers. There's, there's no way. No! Thank you, Izzard. Jeez. Why did they have Izzard on the bench, man? Izzard's a great player, man. He deserves to be in the, in the, in the real side. Oh, oh yes, go, 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 Smith, go, Smith, go, Paul Smith, hits the rookie, Paul Smith, it's Paul Smithy. Let's give it away. It's uh, done. He's in, he's in, surely, 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 that's a try. Yes, okay. Okay, uh, I did win. I win. Should be, what do you mean? It's extra time. But, um, uh, now I'm gonna show you what happens if you do. Okay, now I'm gonna exit out of the, the career mode for a second. And we're going to go into the casual player single player match mode. Okay. Okay. Oh yes, and by the way, if you like want to like reload, uh, like a, a, a different mod, your c c c career save file might be uh, will be lost. I haven't found that a way to fix that. So, <laughs> but uh, if you want help on that, c c contact uh, the maker of the mod. So here we go. We'll just go into this now. Look at this. Looks fine so far, right? Teams. 
Look at this game. Panthers, you know, sharks. Seems fine so far, right? Wrong. Look at these jerseys. They're completely messed up. We've got the Raiders, uh, we've got the Seagulls, the Seagulls, and I think that's under 13s. These, th what? These are the current Rabbitohs. The hell? Look at this. If you've got to manage Panthers, look. Look at this, okay? They're, they're all the same. They're all the same players. So, this mod will only work if you enter the 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 career mode, which I'm perfectly fine with. Uh, I love the uh, the career mode. Oh yeah, and just in case there's going to be people in the comments saying, "Oh, it's just because like he oh he, he didn't pick uh, um, NSWRL 1991." Well, there is a one, an option to. So yes, sorry about that. Um, if we go to uh, the representatives, we got you know the state of origin, all that jazz, which is really cool. Uh, so yeah, that's basically it for my review on this mod. But it's time for the special announcement. Now, if we go on to here, um, oh yeah, contact Ichi Haram if you have any issues with the mod. Not me. Okay. I think you're gonna know where I'm gonna get at here. I now have. A Twitch account, okay? Uh, I'll be live a couple times. Uh, I've already done two live streams. Um, I'll leave the link to my Twitch channel in the description uh, so that you guys can go and check that out. Um, but yeah, I now have a Twitch channel. That should be all for now. I've teached you how to install the mod. How to install everything. So, uh, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye, guys.